Hey guys, welcome to the Gear Up Show. Today we're going to be checking out some cool products from a company called Bang Tai. And they make, as you may have guessed, some cool little titanium stuff. Yep. That seems to be their, uh, their little niche. And it's a lot of keychain items and some other just small EDC gear. Mm -hmm. um, those of you who are deep in the EDC world, maybe you are familiar with Bang Tai, but um, for those who are not familiar with them, cool little company to go check out. To be honest, I don't really know that much about the company other than they've got some neat stuff you can find on Amazon. Yeah. Today we're gonna to be looking at um, this little keychain, uh, key ring and carabiner set mm. that I picked up. And then they've got sort of a larger, more advanced key ring organizer, I would say. Carabiner yeah. clip, kind of. And then a mystery product. It's a keychain toothpick. <laughs> All right, Aaron, well, why don't we start with first the, the sort of the small basic key ring and, yeah. and uh, a little character. So I like this key ring a lot. It kind of reminds me of the Orbit key, uh, key ring in that it's just way easier to use and has more thought put into it right. than sort of standard key ring that you use because everyone has trouble or maybe just me. Right, no everyone has. Uh, everyone has trouble with those things you're trying to get your keys well, on. You're gonna damage your fingernails and this has a slightly different take yeah. on how to solve that problem of like having to pry your fingernail. Yeah. <laughs> so these guys have sort of a, a different take on how to solve that problem than Orbit Key. Mm -hmm. And um, it's kind of really elegant and neat and I'm sure it's been done a million times, but uh, I like it. Feel free to explain it. All right, well, basically instead of prying it open, you just, you just push it sideways mm -hmm. with your finger and then you can put your keychain in. It's uh, pretty easy to get on and off. Again, you just push it to the side, spin it around, it's good to go. Super convenient. So just to wrap up on it, uh, I like the just the simplicity of it. Uh, it's just all one piece that's yeah. either, I don't know if it's laser cut or water cut or, or wire EDM, but it's just all cut from a single piece of titanium. Uh, it's just really kind of an elegant solution. Yeah. All right. So next up is this little mini mini carabiner, mm -hmm. <laughs> um, and it's again it's all one piece of titanium that uses the, the springiness of the titanium to mm -hmm. open and close. Um, it does have a good sort of locking feel to it. So it's designed so that you can just take your your key ring, clip it onto the carabiner, and then this carabiner clips you know onto your belt loop, your pants, your backpack, yeah, whatever. If that's the way you like to carry your keys. Yes, I like like the the feel of all of it. Right. Like all of this feels like it's really quality and uh, maybe I could break it in my hands if I tried really hard. Right. But like it's not um, going to fall to pieces immediately. So next up we have this. It's like a slightly larger carabiner style clip. It has like this larger section at the top that you use to clip onto your pants, your backpack, whatever. Right. And at the bottom is for, uh, I believe, key rings. Yeah, I think it's it's intended to be just like a little segregated key ring area so you can, you can put one key ring or multiple key rings on there. It's kind of a key ring organizer clip, I guess. Um, and just having that other compartment just keeps them sort of separate. And then you can add or remove keychains as you need. Mm -hmm. um, and I like that this has a little bit bigger area for your belt loop. Um, this one was a little bit, the smaller one was a little tricky to get onto my belt. Mm -hmm. But um, this is just a little more substantial. And all of these, have a very distinct titanium ring to yeah, it. Yeah, real titanium. Come get it. So one thing about both of these that I've noticed, right. it's kind of what you just said, which is that they can be kind of difficult to uh, clip onto like your pants or what have you. Like right. the, the opening is really narrow. Yeah. Um, the carabiner I use, it's just kind of gigantic. Right. And so I can do it blind <laughs> yeah. with one hand. And so that's one of the things I really don't like about these. Right. Well, they're a little, in, in, in my opinion, they're a little bit on the small side, but, which could be a good thing. Um, this one in particular. It's just a little small. So yeah, it's harder to do when you're not looking, mm -hmm. but it's also not big and bulky, although you seem like a big carabiner. Yeah, I, I don't mind it. Like, I'm not trying to be super light right. with ABC. All right. Uh, and finally, Aaron, do you want to tell them what this neat little Yeah, it's a product? toothpick. Uh, yeah. A toothpick keychain tool, mm -hmm. if you will, made of titanium. Yes, of course. <laughs> so it just uh, it has this little carry case that you actually put onto the keychain earring, uh, and inside you find the pick, and obviously they screw together. And I like this in concept and in execution, right? Because conceptually, like every time I've ever needed a toothpick, I didn't have a toothpick, right? Or like floss or whatever. 
So like actually having one on you in a way that is aesthetic and um, not obstructive, yeah. I think is awesome. It's, it does fit on your keychain well for sure because mm -hmm. it's it's really small. And the eternal <laughs> question, is, yeah. the <laughs> eternal <laughs> question. Now that I have just realized this, the eternal question of can it be used as a weapon? Mm -hmm. Clearly, this can be used. Yes. As, ow, as a as a weapon. Definitive yes, and for that reason, you probably won't get on a plane with it. But yeah. um, so you're just gonna have to have stuff in your teeth while you're flying, or use regular toothpicks. Uh, but yeah, it is uh, as you mentioned. It's just it has a nice sort of feel to it. It's the right size, um, super light because it's titanium, and yeah, it does kind of turn into a gnarly little weapon. Or then you can also use it. Ow. Yeah. yeah. Maybe as like a leather punch or something. Yeah. <laughs> Leather punch. I'm a little punch, scared to use this as a toothpick. Why? I don't know. I like that uh, as a point. Maybe just the metal on my teeth just feels like ah, like you're at the dentist. Yeah, I like it. I don't know, but um, I'm sure it works. You just wipe it clean. And well, it comes with a oh, brush as well. That's right. It did come with a little cleaning brush. I think that's more for the case than the toothpick itself. But anyway, if you're in the market for a small portable toothpick or just some cool little titanium keychain tools, we know everyone likes titanium. Check them out. Probably the best place to find them is just on Amazon. They got some cool little titanium products and a pretty economical price. Yeah, but you can also find them at banggood.com. <laughs> That's true. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you like the content, be sure to hit subscribe, ring the bell, and we'll see you next week.